Welcome to the bathroom. <laughs> I just noticed you can see my breath in here at the moment. Yeah, try and do it this way. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I can see. That's <laughs> not cool. <laughs> well, it is cool, but. It's bloody freezing. <laughs> well, the time has come to dust off the old scanner and get scanning. And here are all the pages. Look at that thick stack now. Oh, it's a big boy. I'm gonna scan them all in today and hopefully make a start on uh, lining them for you guys. Approximately 10 hours later. Well, there we go. It was a bit of a long slog, but they are all scanned in. So now I need to ink them on the computer, make a cover, and then we should be pretty close to being ready. Look. <laughs> Look how cozy you are, oh my god! So in last week's vlog, because I was showing how cold it is, and as you've probably seen me breathing in the bathroom. In the bathroom, yeah. One of our patrons called Melody said go and check on Coffee, and on Coffee they'd sent me um, a little donation and like a link to a heated blanket thing, which I didn't oh, know Oh, is that existed. what the button's for? So this is what this is, and Ooh. it's got, let me try to show you it. It's got like a battery oh, I'm, bank. I'm hiding. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that you fully charge and put in there. Oh yeah, and then that heats the. Yeah, because um, electricity Ooh. is really expensive at the moment. I think it is everywhere. Yeah. Especially here, I don't know about. Oh my god, the UK. J j basically, the UK. Don't come here. At the moment. It's, <laughs> it's too, too expensive, expensive and depressing. <laughs> don't come here. But now, because I can charge this with like basically what I used to charge my phone. Yeah, I'm, it's I'm like finding much cheaper. a cheaper way to. Keep oh, that's so wholesome. So thank you so much, Melody. You. Melody, you have literally saved Steph's life this Christmas. <laughs> oh, and also, oh, thank you for modelling it, my dear. Uh, I've dug out while I was cleaning this little uh, <laughs> bird box, and we were originally going to do a video on those. Yeah, when we used to live near the woods. Just before we got evicted, yeah, yeah. But I dug that out today, and because it's made of wood, I thought it... <laughs> the unfortunately named Simptac Markers. <laughs> I think they would go really well with that. So at some point, I want to have a sit down with you guys. And, and have like a little paint. paint Try and make it like a little Christmas box and maybe find somewhere to hang it up in the house. Do you know whereabouts mine is? I'll dig it out. Oh, yeah, because okay. we've got two, haven't we? I found yeah. that one, so the other can't be too far away. <laughs> oh no. That, that's a guinea pig pose. Oh, what's that doing there? <laughs> Why did that get on the table? But Silva, who's been a very, very kind, generous, and just all around sweet person, sent us these last year. Yeah, this was like a good like year or two ago and they're uh, little Christmas decorations. They're Christmas tree ornaments, but they have the babies on them. Oh, well, big son, and I keep them on my desk. <laughs> they're so sweet. I mean, we haven't put up a tree yet. Honestly, I'm kind of nervous to put up a tree. I'm scared that we- As soon as we celebrate, I feel like we'll get evicted. Yeah, <laughs> but we don't, Steph's literally just been like, oh yeah, it's Christmas now. And uh, Steph's had those on her desk, no joke, the all sketchbook. year. Oh yeah, all the babies. Next to the poo, how aesthetic. We got a text suddenly. Oh God, don't, nice. don't remind me. It's literally, as you guys will know from last year, it's around this time last year that we were, that we were evicted and our landlord sent me a text message last night and I literally pooed my pants. So our landlord said he wants to see us tomorrow <laughs> and he says he's got a Christmas present for us. We've never met or spoke to the landlord. <laughs> Can you imagine if it was his eviction notice? I know. <laughs> I've got such like bad experiences with landlords. Why does he want to see us? What did we do? That's not normal. We've... So we'll have to like update you. It'll probably be a next week's vlog. Yeah, we've like never missed rent or anything. Oh my god, I'm scared. Well, he says it's a Christmas present, but what if he gives us a present and then says, "Sorry, you've got to move out." It's not a present. I'd say you can have it back. <laughs> What are, you, what are you hiding down there? Okay, my friend Tyler for Christmas has sent me some <gasps> little Ooh! road washi tips. Oh my god! It reminds me of the, you know, like the meme car mat. Yeah, I used to want one of those as a kid. They were so cool. Oh, those are adorable. There's road. <gasps> There's train rails. Yeah, I oh! used the train track one in my sketchbook, which I'll have to show you a That's bit later awesome. on. That's awesome. That's such a cool present. Oh my god. Aren't they awesome? I love those. I'm excited to build some rods in my artwork. <laughs> what else you got hiding down there? This one's already open. <laughs> my friend Sam sent me these. Um, they're, uh, what is that? Oh! Mix. 
because that's like an American snack that we don't get over here. Yeah, that's true. And those are all the fun chips that you get, which as soon as I saw it, I was like, I need oh, to try wow. these. So what do you, I'm just looking at the back, corn chex pretzels, a cracker, wheat chex, a pretzel and a squiggle breadstick. I really like and, them because um, they're crunchy. We don't get these here, do we? Like you say, so. But she's been loving them. That's like oh, becoming one of her uh, favorite cheese snacks. Oh, what's that? It's a key ring making kit. Oh, that's adorable. So we'll have to have a go at making a key ring together because we can Ooh. use like paint markers. We could use the simp tap mm -hmm. and then seal it in maybe. That's such a thoughtful, oh my God, that's adorable. And, and we've we also got... found the birdhouse recently as well. It's like a hundred in. We could... Everyone gets a keychain. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that's a lot of keychains. Oh my God. And then a blast. I have no idea what this is. She just said that this was like a, a random surprise gift. Oh. It's vacuum sealed. What's it look like on the other side? Oh um, god, it's got eyes. Of eyes. <laughs> oh, um, it's like roadkill. Look okay, at that so thing. Okay, so it's got like a tab thing to open. I Release can't it. Make out what it's. I have no it. idea what it this looks thing like is. Maybe like a snail or a slug or something. Your guess is as good as mine. What the heck is that? No way. <laughs> is it a headband? <laughs> is that what it is? And and wristbands? <laughs> I wasn't expecting. I thought it was going to be like a plush. Or what something. the heck is that thing? <laughs> you need to go over it. Oh, there you go. You've got it, sweetheart. <laughs> what? The oh my god! <laughs> what is that? Do I look cute? <laughs> oh, you always look cute, dear. We're very lucky, guys, to have a small but such loving community. We really do love and appreciate. Uh, every single one of you. Especially this one, look at her. <laughs> the picture of fashion over here. Welcome to the guinea blanket, guys. I was digging around and I came across this. I haven't used a Tantone sketchbook in like forever. And I think this is one that is actually complete. So I thought we'd have a little go through it, have a little tour, and then maybe try and redraw one of them. <gasps> oh my god, there's Una stuff. R really old Una stuff in here. Oh my god. That's cool. I haven't... Oh, hello, dear. <laughs> she is here, by the way. I haven't dated any of these. It'd you be interesting. <laughs> yeah, well, it'd be interesting to know when I did them. It was but... before your anime affairs. Absolutely. <laughs> my, my face. <laughs> Thanks, dear. You're welcome. I do love, though, and I was going to mention just how well Tantone sketchbooks like uh, pick out like uh, white and black yeah, because the tan such like a neutral tone the rest really pops out it's been a while since you've used it I know I, well I think I need to get a new one. Oh my god mood do you see what I mean by how the tan's like a nice neutral color and it makes everything else pop reminds me of better than that <laughs> Ooh. it looks like I did a lot of um post studies in this which makes sense because i still do those like now a ballerina. a ballerina one yeah little bird person i really liked doing the eyes <gasps> white hair oh my god oh my god i want to do white hair now i might have to draw like if i do a redraw i might do this one and maybe draw it here because i love the idea of white hair i'd have to find like a white pencil though i'm not sure where i'd find oh, one do you have a white paint marker Oh, well, we could try that, sure. Oh my god, I think that's like a drawing of my dad. Oh, Monica. That's a Monica's. Oh my gosh, I hope Monica's doing well. I wonder if Monica still watches these videos. Monica was like one of the first ever online art friends that we ever made. And she's from Poland and she's an incredible illustrator. She's done like quite a few uh, kids books now and uh, made a name for herself there. She does really wonderful stuff. Oh, there we go, see? Look at those popping colors. Mm. Yeah. Love drawing characters with baseball bats. I know, why? Why is that? There's another, see, like a lot of dryad stuff because Monica's also very good at drawing dryads. Or is it dryads? I don't know how to pronounce I've it. i said dryad. Dryad, yeah. I might have just picked that up from you. From me, probably, yeah, but I do like them. Let me know, how do you say it? How do you say it? Oh, and of course, elves and stuff. I love fantasy things. So elves are always going to be up there. Shy girls like Steph when I give her a compliment. She does that. You, that's such a tell when you're embarrassed. You uh, tuck your hair behind your ear. A mermaid. <laughs> oh, God, I really miss it. I want to buy a tan sketchbook now looking through these. Normally, I just hate everything I've ever done, which, <laughs> which is kind of true. But the tan stuff looks really fun. I haven't done anything like this in ages. I was thinking maybe 
I could uh, get a sketchbook, not a big one, oh my god, a small one to practice hands and feet in. Because I, I still struggle with those, like, to this day. Again, I don't know what it is about the eyes, like, um, it's just really satisfying doing eye whites in a Tantone sketchbook. As another dryad one. Oh, I think this was for a mermaid one, if I remember rightly. Do you remember when mermaid was a... Well, it is still a it thing. Still is <laughs> but yeah, that was for mermaid. So that must have been like, what? Two... I'm trying to guess when I did most of these. 2016? Like, yeah, 2016, 2017. Yeah, I remember that. That's a Pinterest lady. I remember... Ooh, tattoo girl. Yeah, yeah, that was a Pinterest one. I remember that one. See, more eyes. Eyes and teeth. It's, it's like, you, it just draws you to it. It's so hard for me to explain. I'm having a bit of an autism moment, but it, it, I don't know what it is. And the whites on the clothes and stuff as well. Maybe I might draw that one. I don't know. I've, it's actually been really fun looking through this one. Normally, I like I say, I hate everything that I draw. There's an elf one. I like the hands on that one. That one's pretty fun. Okay, so let me scooch my butt over. And I'm gonna try and draw, redraw like this one, because I do like that. Although I haven't found a white pencil yet, but we'll make do. We'll make do. Gosh, I really wish I knew exactly when I uh, drawn this. But it, like I was saying with Steph, it must really be a. It's got to be around, you know, 2016-17 when. Uh, the Zootopia era. Yeah, there's yeah yeah, and um, I was very like inspired by like. Uh, the Disney like art style and stuff. You well, you guys can go back and see. I was very uh, inspired by it in like the videos and stuff that we would do. And completely butcher in this picture because I'm so nervous. They've got a very snatched waist. Okay. Oh, and she's got like a big X on her shirt. Isn't that weird? Because I drawn this in uh, 2015. Oh 16. yeah, and that's like the new Twitter logo. Yeah, and that's like. That's what that is now. That's so strange. Adam predicted the future. It's like when The Simpsons does it. But oh my Adam. god, that'd be such a cool TV show. Like a person that has like premonitions about the future, but it's in everything that they draw and they don't realize. That's a Netflix show right there. Oh my god. We don't need that Netflix show because you are that person. Oh, am I that person? Oh, okay, Netflix, get in contact with me. We'll talk. No, Netflix cancel everything you don't want them to do. Oh, okay, Netflix, don't. If you call, I won't answer. <laughs> <laughs> That's such a mood. I won't answer to anyone. I'm scared of the telephone. <laughs> oh, honey. There we go. I mean, I'm making do with what I've got because I, uh, I can't find any. Ever since we went out and drawn with our friend, I can't find any of my art supplies. I'm starting to actually worry that I left the stuff I was using there. Oh, well, we've got the unbreakable pencil, guys. I guess I could go in and do some details with that. Although, it's not. I wish these. These wouldn't be so bad if they were soft. But I think these, the more I've used these over time, I actually think these aren't even HB. I think they're some kind of H pencil. And that, you know, something that's hard, so they can be like, oh, it's unbreakable, it's amazing. But um, it just means that you can't get any color out of it, and it's super, like, brittle. <laughs> Steph has just saved me with the simp tap <laughs> markers. It's a white, so it should work. And just so I can put one there as well. Yes, there is. Thank you, my dear. It. Now I might have to be a little bit extra careful here, but it does mean I can go in and do those eye whites that I was fanboying about earlier. Oh my gosh, I've also got a bunch of things that I discovered from a friend. Um, from a few months ago. Oh yeah. Which are QT toes that I need to open. Ooh. So I'm not sure whether to open those in this vlog or to do that for our next week vlog. Oh we should oh my god, we should start next week's with that. Let's start with a high. <laughs> yeah, start with a high. Start off strong. Now. You can't let me forget though, because I keep forgetting. Like <laughs> you would forget about QT toes. Oh my god. <laughs> oh there we go, that's really helping dear. Because I was worried that I wouldn't be able to replicate it as well. Isn't that terrifying? Do you guys ever do that? Do you ever do like a redraw? And then when you're done, you take a step back and you look at it and you think that it's worse <laughs> than what you used to do. You're like, oh, oh no, you know? See, that's another reason why I really like these because the SimTap ones have such like a, a fine tip to them. It means that you can get in really close with the details and the nips aren't like super soft because I, oh god, I hate it when they're super soft. But these are quite stiff and they can like put up with like Mr. Like Heavy Hands over here. 
and hopefully as well in next week's video I'll have an update with the dogs with jobs. I, like I said, I was. And I showed you cutie doll. Yeah, because I shown you some earlier, but it's just like you know, at the minute I'm just thinking them, so I'm going over, basically what I've already shown. So I'm like, uh, do people really want to see that, or would they rather just wait until I've done them all? I mean, let me know. I can share some of the process, but it's literally just me going over what I've already done. So I'm not quite sure what to do. Oh, that looks so much better, honey. You're such a genius. <laughs>